and bush orders with high win rates. Thank you for watching video. This is the daily chart of Euro Yen. Here is today's price action. It is a bull. The point is that the distance to the low is short. There is only a short distance to the low after the candlestick has formed. This is the kind of place to aim for. Here is 118.897 and the low is 118.855. So the move is only 5 pips or so. This kind of move is very easy to take. The method is simple. Just put in a wait with a sell stop order. It is 60 because the price has already risen like this. It does not mean that we are predicting that the price will rise from here because it is rising. There is of course a possibility that the price will rise from here. However, you have a higher probability of winning at a higher rate if you wait with a sell stop order. Put a sell stop order and wait. The price has moved quite a bit like this. Make it one hour. This vertical line is today's movement. On the right side is today's movement, where the price has moved about 60 over the past five hours. After this, you should trade with an eye on the price coming back up. You do not have to look for the price to go up or down from this point. In other words, it can move either way. It doesn't matter if the price goes up or down. All we do is ambush. We simply put a stop order to sell and wait. You can use a tool, stop order, press the button and it automatically goes in like this. This also has a trailing stop set. So if the order is hit, the order will be executed automatically when it reaches the target after this. 10 or so, sell is entered and then the price will come back up. This is the price going up and you simply ambush it and take it on the subsequent move. You can do it this way automatically. This price movement does not predict whether the price is going to go up or down. Predicting it takes a lot of effort, and it takes time to analyze it. Therefore, we target where the reaction has already occurred. If prices are already rising, sell. If, on the other hand, it is falling, we trade by buying. It is very important to ambush. Most people try to find out if the price will rise or fall from that point. It is difficult to analyze that. It's hard to hit a moving target, right? Which is more difficult, aiming at a stationary target or a moving one? It is easier to aim at a stationary object. The latest price is always moving. It is very difficult to predict whether these moving prices will rise or fall. But there is no need to do that. Just place an ambush order. Either the price reaches the target, or the stop loss is triggered, or the trailing stop is executed. Either of these will complete the trade. This is especially true for lows and highs, but also when the candle opens and the price has not moved much. That is where you should aim for. The winning rate will naturally be higher. It is very easy to do. There is no need to stare at the chart. You can save a lot of time and increase your profit margin. This is what ambush orders are for. By using stop orders, you can trade more efficiently. If you have any further questions, please contact us. Thank you.